Multiple anglers pulled to safety after getting stranded on the ice on the Bay of Green Bay. NBC 26's Jennifer Nazza is live at 5 now with what happened. Jennifer? Stacy, the Brown County Sheriff's Department tells us a total of 14 people were rescued from the ice coming out of Volk's Landing off Edgewater Beach Road in the town of Scott. Police say it was just before 10 a.m. when they received the call about the stranded anglers. The Sheriff's Office tells us the New Franken Fire Department, County Rescue, Wisconsin DNR, and U.S. Coast Guard came to assist with the rescue. They say the ice started shifting out from shore with a 50-foot crack opening that later became half a mile wide. The fishermen tell us they initially did not know what was going on, but when they did find out, fear started to sink in. Very nervous because you hear about this every year and uh, you hear about guys going floating off and occasionally people do drown. Officials tell us the Brown County airboat brought all the fishermen back to shore safely and no one was hurt. Deputies say Bayside Ice Recovery helped the fishermen get their gear back and the scene was cleared around noon. The Brown County Sheriff's Office tells us they also would like to remind everyone to check the ice conditions before venturing out onto the ice because warm weather can quickly deteriorate it. The DNR also says to watch out for strong winds as well. Jennifer Nazza, NBC 26. Thank you, Jennifer. And another angler had to be rescued from the ice today farther north along the Bay of Green Bay. It happened near Red River County Park. The DNR says wind conditions also to blame for stranding that fisherman. This time of the year, the, the ice is definitely not safe. I, if I'm checking fishermen, it's going to be at the shorelines this time of the year when they come back in. It's just it's not safe enough for us to go out there. The DNR says even if the temperature is around freezing, be aware that temperatures around 32 degrees still won't make a lot of ice.